Royal Shrewsbury Hospital and she is about to set off on a challenge with her boyfriend to raise money towards her dad's cancer treatment in the Philippines. Uh, April, morning to you. Hi, good morning, Ryan. Good morning. Talk to me about this challenge because this is quite incredible. What is it that you and your boyfriend are looking to do? Yeah, oh my God. So it's called the Kick Scooter Challenge. Um, it's on um, a very famous cycling route called the Sea to Sea where it's basically a cycling route from the Irish Sea to the North Sea. It's about 130 miles, and we're trying to do it in six days on a manual kick scooter. So describe the kick scooter you're doing this on, then. Right, so, um, you know the little um, scooters that kids normally have? Now, make that um, with almost wheels that can go off-road, a bigger wheel at the front, and can hold basically an adult weight. So it's an off-road adventure scooter, you might put it. Wow. Okay. So, how how are you feeling as as this challenge is is about to get underway, April? Oh my God! No words, Ryan. It's it's <laughs> it's, it's a mix of um, just energy, just nervous, energetic energy. Um, it's I'm fueled so much with love. I've got my uh, mom and dad listening to the radio right now, and they're just like fueling me with "You can do it." It's a good day. Uh, they're weather watching as well, and I'm just like um, I'm I'm just it's, it's a very surreal moment to actually have this day start, you know? And, and I mentioned you're doing this for your dad. How, how is he doing? Uh, actually, he's in, he's in really good high spirits. He's in a very good place right now. He's just finished his third chemo. He's booked now for two more cycles, and that just means that uh, we're closer and closer now to the next phase of his treatment, which is what we're actually preparing for. And that, that's obviously why you're doing this challenge yes. as well. yes. If if people want to donate to your scooting the C two C for cancer fundraising challenge, well, what's the what's the best thing to do, April? Oh yeah, sure. I've got a GoFundMe page, okay. um, and if you Google basically or go on GoFundMe page and search "scooting for cancer," I come up. Um, my name's April, and so it's it's I'm the one organizing it, and it will just say "scooting for cancer." It will have uh, a way for you to donate on it. Okay, you're about to get underway, aren't you? On this. Yes, yes, we're uh, we're actually in the lakes right now. We're going through our last checks, um, go to the pier, uh, and yeah, set off uh, hopefully before midday, and then get there before dark. <laughs> <laughs> That's the challenge. Oh, I hope I hope it goes really well today, April. Uh, yes, yes, uh, us too. Yes, we've got the sun up here, so fingers crossed. You've you've got the conditions. I I, I feel you're hoping to get all this done today. Is that right? Um, just for the first leg, so we've, yeah. um, we've, um, uh, we're going to try 30 to 40 K each day. So this is actually the shortest leg into, um, the middle of the lake, into North Lakes. Um, and then we'll gradually go through the lakes and the Pennines and hopefully down to Tyne Castle come next Friday. We, we might try and catch up with you later in the week if that's all right. Is uh, that okay? Yeah, no, that's great. Yeah. I'll tell you all about it. The good, <laughs> the bad, the ugly, everything. <laughs> oh, fabulous. Hope it goes well today. Thank, thank you, April and, and her boyfriend, uh, who are heading off on that coast to coast fundraising challenge on kick scooters. If you put that, that appeal, scooting for cancer, uh, into GoFundMe, you will find out more about what they are doing and help them raise money for that fabulous cause. And they have got nice weather for it today, Natasha. Hello, yeah, it's a lovely day actually for getting out and about and uh, it's going to be the same tomorrow. We do have a few showers in the forecast today, starting dry with plenty of sunshine, just some patchy cloud which will stay with us through the day. But as that builds into the afternoon, we will get a few showers moving in from the east through the course of the day. Those easing though as we go into the evening and giving us a few more sunny spells. Temperatures today highs of around 17 degrees Celsius and we do have just a gentle north northeasterly breeze so this evening then any of those lingering showers that cloud starting to clear away through the first part of the night to leave quite a dry and clear night to come it will be cool though with temperatures dropping to around just three or four degrees celsius so a chilly start then to the day on sunday sunny though plenty of sunshine around first thing we do have that cloud building in though from